سورت العلق بسم الله الرحمن الرحيم الله کے نام سے جو بڑا مہربان نہایت رحم والا ہے اقرا بسم ربك الذي خلق اے نبی پڑھیے اپنے رب کے نام کے ساتھ جس نے پیدا کیا خلق الانسان من علق جمع ہوئے خون کے ایک لوتھڑے سے انسان کی تخلیق کی اقرا وربك الاكرم پڑھیے اور آپ کا رب بڑا کریم ہے الذي علم بالقلم جس نے قلم کے ذریعے سے علم سکھایا علم الانسان ما لم يعلم انسان کو وہ علم دیا جسے وہ نہ جانتا تھا كلا ان الانسان ليطغى ہرگز نہیں بلکہ انسان سرکشی کرتا ہے اس بنا پہ کہ وہ اپنے آپ کو غنی دیکھتا ہے حالانکہ پلٹنا یقیناً تیرے رب ہی کی طرف ہے تم نے دیکھا اس شخص کو جو ایک بندے کو منع کرتا ہے جبکہ وہ نماز پڑھتا ہو ارائیت ان کان علی الہدا تمہارا کیا خیال ہے اگر وہ بندہ راہ راست پر ہو او امر بالتقوا یا پرہیزگاری کی تلقین کرتا ہو ارائیت ان کذب وتولا تمہارا کیا خیال ہے اگر یہ منع کرنے والا شخص حق کو جھٹلاتا اور منہ موڑتا ہو الم یعلم بان اللہ يرى کیا وہ نہیں جانتا کہ اللہ اسے دیکھ رہا ہے كلا لئن لم ينته لنسفعا بالناصيه ہرگز نہیں اگر وہ باز نہ آیا تو ہم اس کی پیشانی کے بال پکڑ کے اسے کھینچیں گے ناصيه كاذبه خاطئه اس پیشانی کو جو جھوٹی اور سخت کار ہے وہ بلا لے اپنے حامیوں کی ٹولی کو ہم بھی عذاب کے فرشتوں کو بلا لیں گے ہرگز نہیں اے نبی آپ اس کی بات نہ مانے اور سجدہ کریں اور اپنے رب کی قربت حاصل کریں
रखवाले I'm Dr. Mautil Hani, uh, moderator for today's event, and I'm so excited to welcome you all to this session, where we are formally launching Pakistan Orthoscopy and Sports Surgery Society. But first, let me wish you all Happy Independence Day, and let's all pray for the success of our beloved country, Pakistan. POA Orthoscopy Forum was uh, initially established in 2014 with an aim to develop orthoscopy and sports surgery in Pakistan. With the dedication and hard work of its faculty and members, it has now established its credential as a training and academic forum. Now, it is time to showcase the world its true potential by doing more research and publication, thus getting more recognition. Therefore, PUA Forum is now upgraded to Pakistan Orthoscopy Sports Surgery Society Path. It is a platform for all orthopedic doctors interested in orthoscopy and sports surgery, to showcase their work and share knowledge with experts. POA Arthroscopy Forum has organized meetings, webinars, and different conferences in past to spread the knowledge of arthroscopy and sports injury. Our past also aims to continue the same. Let us all join hands together to help us reach greater height. 14th August 2021 uh, shall not be remembered as a key moment for the launching of the society, but also the inauguration of past website. The website shall be a great source to seek all recent updates about the society and developments in the world of arthroscopy. Please feel free to check out the website at www.paaas.org now. And with that, let's move on to the introductory package of the society and website. Welcome to the virtual launching ceremony of Pakistan Arthroscopy and Sports Surgery Society. We are spreading knowledge in education, research and patient care in arthroscopy, knee surgery and orthopedic sports medicine. First video arthroscopy workshop organized at CPSP on 25th April 1998. POA Pakistan Orthopedic Association Arthroscopy Forum was established in 2014 by the POA board headed by President POA Professor M. Parvez Anjum and Secretary General Dr. Masood Umar on 8th March 2014 with Dr. Khalid Mahmood Shah as chairman. P 
POA Arthroscopy Forum is committed to the growth and development of the orthopedic fraternity, orthroscopy and sports surgery in Pakistan. It is constantly taking measures to ensure excellence in the community. With the passage of time and growth, POA Forum members and faculty invested their time and expertise to disseminate the knowledge and techniques of arthroscopic surgery. It was the view of the forum members that we have come of age and a decision was taken to upgrade the forum to a full-fledged society, namely Pakistan Orthroscopy and Sports Surgery Society PAS. The name of the cabinet members are as followed: Khalid Mahmood Shah, President; Masood Umar, Vice President; Zahid Askar, General Secretary; Ghulam Mahboob, Treasurer. Shams Tabrez, Director Corporate, Commercial and Public Affairs. Malik Javed Iqbal, Chair Membership. Sajjad Hassan, Executive Member. Pakistan Arthroscopy and Sports Surgery Society PAS has been organizing hands-on skills workshop on arthroscopic techniques and sports surgery all over Pakistan. To date, it has organized 24 workshops, seminars and run session during Orthocon annual conferences. Pakistan Ni Arthroscopy Registry PKAR was launched at the 30th Park Orthocon 2016. Pakistan Ni Arthroscopy Registry PKAR plays a vital role in the development of the registry to gauge the real world practices, patient outcomes, safety, and comparative effectiveness of the arthroscopy cases conducted in Pakistan. We are pleased to announce that our new website is now live. The site has been designed to deliver and share all the updates of Pakistan Arthroscopy and Sports Surgery Society in a truly amazing experience. We will have a lot of updates to share in our website portal. Please follow us. I shall now ask the permission of President Pakistan Orthoscopy and Sports Surgery Society to officially launch the society and website. Can we commence now? I shall now ask Dr. Khalid Mahmood Shah, President, PA, Triple S, to please say a few words. Thank you very much, Dr. Mahathar. 
Uh, dear colleagues, assalamu alaikum. It is my privilege and honor to welcome you all on the official launch of Pakistan Arthroscopy and Sports Surgery Society today. We started our journey as POA Arthroscopy Forum, which was established in 2014 by Pakistan Orthopedic Association with an aim to develop arthroscopy and sports surgery in Pakistan. The forum organized a series of over 24 hands-on skills workshops on arthroscopic techniques and sports surgery across Pakistan. With the dedication and hard work of its faculty and members, it established its credential as a training and academic forum. Today, it is a proud moment for all of us to announce that the forum has now come of age and become a full-fledged society committed to excellence in arthroscopy and sports surgery. PLAS platform is for all uh, orthopedic doctors, surgeons interested in arthroscopy and sports injuries to showcase their work and share knowledge with experts. We will continue to organize meetings, webinars, and different conferences to spread the knowledge of arthroscopy and sports injuries. Please feel free to join us and give your valuable suggestions to help us to reach greater heights. Thank you very much for your support. I shall now ask Dr. Masood Umar, Vice President Pass, to please say a few words on this auspicious occasion. Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. Assalamu alaikum. This is Dr. Masood Umar. Uh, I'm an orthopedic surgeon at Al Khan University, Karachi, and it's a privilege to be addressing you today on this historic event of the launch of Pakistan Arthroscopy and Sports Surgery Society in Pakistan. And uh, this um, obviously coincides with this auspicious day of our uh, of 14th August, which is our Independence Day. So a uh, history being created again today in Pakistan. And uh, to begin with uh, a bit about the past, when I was a junior faculty and learning arthroscopy, I did fellowship in arthroscopy and then came back to Al Khan University as a junior faculty and then excelled in learning arthroscopic procedures uh, of the knee and um, continued from there and ultimately we came into teaching and um, by from there till 2013, before 2013 there was no teaching, formalized teaching of arthroscopic work and it was only if you see the poster on in December 2013 that we launched our first basic knee arthroscopic course, obviously with the help of uh, companies that would support us with mannequins and every teaching material. And as you see, the faculty, Dr. Khalid Shah and Dr. Sajad Orgzi are, uh, are members of the current board, Dr. Khalid Shah is the president. So we continued, this was the group photo at that time of the faculty uh, in 2013. The next course was organized in 2014 in the north, which was our Pindi. And the, ultimately it led to formation of a cohesive group, uh, most of which you can see in the current photograph in the front row, uh, who were very eager to teach, uh, to train, and excel in their respective fields of knee arthroscopy and later we projected ourselves into shoulder arthroscopy also and we did multiple courses of shoulder arthroscopy. All of this by that time was being done under the umbrella of Pakistan Arthroscopy Forum and the, as we, as our group matured and enlarged and we gathered more expert people around us, the idea was floated to convert this into a formal independent society that would have its own bylaws, that would have its own bank account, so as to say a financial autonomy to manage its own affairs and also academic affairs. Hence, 
with the tremendous efforts of uh, Dr. Khalid Shah, today we are seeing ultimately uh, after, after many years of perseverance uh, the launch of the society and it's a great moment for us, of all of us in Pakistan to be, uh, to be seeing the light of this day that arthroscopy is being raised to very high levels for surgery training and is being raised to a very high level in Pakistan. So I am quite hopeful this will be the course again in 2018. I am quite hopeful that uh, now academic courses and uh, workshops will continue to prosper. We will also see many fellowships being thrown into existence and um, with the help of uh, all of the colleagues joining in we would have some international stature also, so as to say, to project ourselves in the international community by way of our academics, by way of our fellowship, and by way of our, of our academic content and conduct. So it was a pleasure addressing you again. A great day, and thank you for joining us. Thank you for all the colleagues uh, uh, to listen to me and for helping us out to reach this stage today. Aslam Alaikum. Uh, Kitna time? All right. All right, sir. Yes, sir. I shall now ask Dr. Malik Javed Iqbal, Chairman, Membership, PASS, uh, to say a few words on the occasion. A brief introduction about Dr. Malik. He's a practicing orthopedic surgeon for the last 18 years and uh, he's a specialist in sports injury specifically and uh, he's currently working as a professor at Pakistan International College. Uh, please, Dr. Malik, join us now. Assalamu alaikum, dear colleagues and friends. It gives me immense pleasure to say a few words in the launch of Pakistan Arthroscopic Society of Sports Surgery. Surely, it's a great day today in the history of Pakistan Orthopedic Association and will be remembered as a great occasion. Today, orthopedic surgery is being taken into a new era in Pakistan. It is going to change the way sports surgery is being practiced in our country. The aim of Pakistan Orthoscopic Society of Sports Surgery is to teach and train orthopedic surgeons to practice modern surgical techniques to help mankind. PASS shall be collaborating with other society, similar societies and associations across the globe to share knowledge and expertise. Soon, PASS will be launching a campaign for membership for this society. I request all the personnel who are interested in sports surgery to participate in this membership drive. In the end, I thank you all for taking this your precious time to participate on this great occasion, on this great day, which is our Independence Day. God bless Pakistan and Pakistan Zindabad. I shall now proceed with Dr. Sajad Hassan, executive member, PAS, to please say a few words on this auspicious occasion. Bismillahir Rahmanir Rahim. Thank you, Dr. Mother, for your kind introduction. Uh, when I arrived in Pakistan in 2010, after completing my training abroad, I was amazed to find that there are very few centers where arthroscopy is being performed. And most of these centers were private centers. I was lucky enough to get into contact with few orthopedic surgeons who were as passionate and keen to start training of the young orthopedic surgeons as I was. And this journey from 2014 has been excellent for us. During the days of our forum, we have had many uh, hands-on training sessions. And now the natural evolution is that we have uh, matured into a society. In a society, the advantage is that we can work independently. We can start supervised training in a structured manner to young orthopedic surgeons who are keen to learn the art of arthroscopy and sports surgery. This unfortunately is lacking in Pakistan. With structured training, 
we hope that we will enroll a lot of young orthopedic surgeons to start doing arthroscopic surgery and hopefully this will percolate to local level, eventually benefiting the patients as such. Being in the society also gives us a chance to collaborate with international bodies and hence improve our techniques and understanding of arthroscopy in general. The key emphasis over here should be on supervised structured training. We are blessed with group of people who have had their training abroad and in Pakistan and are passionate about advancing the training of arthroscopy and they are selflessly dedicated themselves for the past many years. Especially, I would like to appreciate Dr. Khalid Shah who have persistently worked in forming this society. In the end, I would like to thank all my members, fellow members who have been selflessly working very hard, each and every one of them in making this a success story. Let's work together with more zeal and fervor to further our cause of making sure that all the young orthopedic surgeons and even old ones like me would have good training in orthopedic surgery, especially the arthroscopy and sports surgery aspect of it. Today is a great day. 74 years ago, our country came into being and this day will also be remembered as the day where the Pakistan Arthroscopic and Sports Surgery Society has started its new journey with a lot of zeal and fervor. I thank you all. All right, we shall now proceed with Dr. Gulab Mahmoud Terrizer uh, Pass, but unfortunately he couldn't join us today and had to leave Karachi on, uh, for some emergency basis. We shall now move on to uh, Dr. Shams Tabriz, Director of Corporate Commercial and Public Affairs Pass. He is a very well regarded orthopedic surgeon and has a number of certifications under his belt. I shall ask him to please say a few words. Bismillah ar-Rahman ar-Rahim. Thank you very much, uh, Dr. Mahathir and uh, Professor Shah Sahib for waking me up seven in the morning. And uh, uh, I'm, as you can see, I'm in the very thanda thanda ilaka. I'm in UK. So just to give you background, uh, I did my first, I assisted my first arthroscope in 1989. So that spans around 32 years ago. And as Sajjad said, when I came to Pakistan uh, back in 2012, I was surprised to see that people didn't know much about uh, arthroscopy, which was a very sad part uh, for our uh, orthopedic services. In comparison to general surgery, laparoscopy was booming. And uh, very, very few people knew about arthroscopy. And then two years down the line, I met uh, the gentleman who is now chairman, uh, Shah Saheb, who we started this forum back in 2014. And by the grace of God today on a very, uh, I don't know what is the right word on this occasion, we have moved into another step, which is the formation of society. And this was four, five, six, seven years of hard work purely hard work, selfless hard work of all my colleagues. Uh, seven of us are here and there are a few more who joined us later as well to develop this. Uh, basically, there was only one purpose to train our juniors and to make them aware that this is something which is 21st century treatment. And we succeeded. I just want to add one thing. As you can see, I'm in UK now that this proposal of inauguration on 14th of August, uh, Dr. Mathur, please note it. It was requested by me, please, that it should be written in gold words, golden words, that 14th August date was, okay. Uh, unfortunately, I couldn't have a green shirt today, uh, which I wanted to wear on this occasion. So I hope to God, we all, with the combined efforts, will succeed 
in taking it to another step. And the only purpose is to train, teach our junior colleagues. And this is 21st century advancement in orthopedics, which is arthroscopy. And I'm sure uh, our worthy vice president must have added a lot of things into it. So we have come from northwest, east of Pakistan. We started from Peshawar, Islamabad, and ended up in Karachi. So I hope and pray to God that this will, our efforts will be fruitful for future of our next generation. Thank you very much. God bless you. All right. Uh, I shall now uh, uh, request Dr. Zahid Askar to please say a few words and thanks participants for joining us in today's sermon. Hi, right. thanks, uh, Dr. Mathur. Um, I thank you all for attending uh, this historical moment. The aim of the today's meeting was officially launch pass. Unfortunately, because of the COVID situation, the launch had to be virtual. 14th August was selected in order to couple this historical event with another much greater historical miracle, the birth of our country, Pakistan. The formation of this society has not been an easy job. This was achieved through a lot of toil and hard efforts by all, especially by our president, Shah Saab. Indeed, it was his vision which forced us to look in this direction. The Pakistan Orthoplastic Society and the Pediatric Orthopedic Society acted as our torch bearers. As we all know, our journey started in 2014 with the birth of Pakistan POA Arthroscopy Forum. The formation of POS was a natural progression in the development of the forum, just like a progression from a baby to an adult. The formation of the forum led to increased awareness of the field. We feel that now we need to improve our knowledge and also our profile internationally, hence the formation of the society. Our this journey has been aided greatly by our Pakistani brothers who are settled abroad. Uh, I would like to thank Manawar Shah, Amir Qureshi, Tariq Zaman, and Nasser Shah for the sincere effort to make us learn the inter intricacies of the subject. Efforts of Khalid Masood and Kamran Bhatt have also gone a long way of teaching us the finer aspects of shoulder and upper limb arthroscopy. Indeed, it's, it's our young surgeons like Wasim, Sanaullah, Qasim, Sufyan, Idris Shah, Naveed Baloch, Hilbah, amongst others, who will represent the future of our society. And they all became interested in this field because of the activities of the POA Forum. And, it, it all, and, and this speaks highly of the efforts of our forum uh, uh, to, spread the, uh, the, uh, uh, to spread the awareness of the field. Various companies have also helped us a lot in the running of various academic activities. I would also like to take this opportunity to thank them all for their help and request their continued support in the future. These companies, amongst others, include Nicholson, Rich International, Carl Strolls, Formatic, Genix, Hilton, Getz, Ryzen, and, and HiQ. But we should not dwell on the past. We need to look at the future. We need to further our skills and make our field the best in the world. We also need to be recognized at international level in order to bring esteem and good name for our country. In this regard, we are about to start a multi-center fellowship in sports surgery in Peshawar, which will also include a fully funded international rotation. The fellowship will be a prototype for the fellowships in the future. And in the, in the last, I want to thank you all for your time and effort. I wish for your continued support in the future. God bless our country, Pakistan, and God bless our society. Thanks.